So assuming you've finished doing the work and uh, you want to upload the solution, so if you go to the dashboard, you will see the confirmed orders, which shows you a list of all the orders which are currently being done. And uh, if you have finished doing one, let's say you have done this one and you want to upload it, so you click the order ID so that it can open for you the the order details page on a new page. So on this page, you will be presented with the, the list of requirements the student uploaded and also some messaging between the student and the admin in this section. So on the, on the left side, you find the details about the time remaining and also you are given a messaging area where you can write a message to the admin yourself. So for now, we want to do upload. So you click this upload solution button that will open a dialog box which asks you which type of assignment you want to upload. Is it a completed one or a partial one? So partial means it is still ongoing. Completed means it has been done. Now it is ready for submission. So you click completed so that it, it gives you these questions you answer. So you just click yes to most of them. So yes, yes. You check these boxes. And in this message box, you just say complete solution uploaded. So and again, another message box here, you just say complete solution uploaded then on this plagiarism report you check this last one i want the company to upload on my behalf so you check that so they'll use their systems plagiarism checker to check the level of plagiarism then you just upload the file you want to upload to the portal so you normally there are a given number of files accepted so you should always bring assignment in docs if there are files which cannot be uploaded, you like for example codes, you put them in zips, zip files, so you can upload the zip as a whole. If there may be some file types which you can't upload, so once you're done, you just check this box. I'm aware that this solution is genuine, correct, and not plagiarized, so it's just like confirming that everything's okay. So once that is done, you just click submit solution. So then the file will be submitted, and you will receive a a confirmation message that the file has been uploaded successfully so for now this was just a demo let me just cancel it yeah so that's basically that's how you upload a, a solution